Hey everyone, how's it going? This is Akash here and you're watching Tech Infinity. So there have been a quite a few leaks about the LG Velvet for a while now. And for a very long time, we have been seeing bits and pieces of leaks. And to me, it somehow seems that LG is deliberately trying to leak this smartphone and create hype around it. Well, they already released a video about it on their Korean YouTube channel. And we already have hands-on pictures and some video footage about this particular device and it is going to launch tomorrow so it is something to look forward to and we know most of the stuff already so as you can see from the screenshots that i'll be providing in this video this smartphone will be having 8 gigabytes of ram and 128 gigs of internal storage and it will also have ip68 resistance against water and dust as well as there will be a mammoth 4300 mAh battery and in addition to that you will expect to see stuff like fast charging and also wireless charging so that's great the weight of this device will be 180 grams and its dimensions will be 167 by 74 by 7.9 so it isn't really a very thin or a very thick device so that's nice seems like a balanced device and as for the display size they are somewhere around 172.7 millimeters full hd plus display and aside from that yes you might be expecting that this smartphone may be a flagship device but it's not actually it's a upper mid-range device in my opinion and this device will be having a qualcomm snapdragon 765 system on chip along with 5g support and it will have a teardrop notch at the front so there's no punch hole display here but i think the teardrop notch isn't that bad it's actually quite minimalistic and i don't hate it and lg has been promoting the design of this smartphone and it is a design focused smartphone and it looks really good from the videos and screenshots and images as you can see and on the rear you can see what they are calling the raindrop camera setup and apart from that you will also see 20.5 is to 9 aspect ratio for the display so this is a tallish kind of a display and it reminds me of xperia series of devices and as for the pricing well we have had several rumors some rumors are quite seen and suggesting that this device will be priced somewhere around 550 dollars while some rumors have just gone insane and saying that it will come at a price of 680 euros or 700 dollars and in my opinion that high of a price isn't really worth this kind of phone so i think lg will actually have to price it right because of the coronavirus pandemic people aren't willing to spend that much on smartphones and some people are tending to hold on to their older devices and looking to buy cheaper phones and even iphone se has become quite popular and has been teased as a threat for all android smartphones that are mid-rangers so that's that but the price here isn't really a mid-ranger this is a flagship level price because 700 dollars is just too much for this kind of phone so i think the price should be around 550 dollars for the variant without the dual screen accessory yes this device will come with a dual screen accessory and as you can see it also has curved edges so i think maybe the higher prices with the dual screen accessory and some additional stuff and this smartphone also has a half a quad dac which many lg phone users love and it is primarily one of the reasons why people prefer to buy lg smartphones because they are the only ones who are keeping around a headphone jack and in addition to that putting in a high dac high quality hi-fi dac and that is just phenomenal so i hope lg prices this particular smartphone quite sensibly and doesn't go crazy so that's it for this video i'll probably make another video tomorrow after this phone actually launches and what kind of features it has what kind of pricing so stay tuned for that and do hit that subscribe and like button thank you for watching have a nice day